Hey you guys, welcome to Melissa Valentine's Nursery. My name is Melissa and we are here in my yard and I have a watermelon, yes, I have a watermelon in my hand. I just got home from work. I put my watermelon down. I just got home from work and I cut up a watermelon and I'm actually gonna take you with me on my morning this morning. Um, we are gonna go shopping and we're gonna go take a baby. But I got home, I cut up watermelon. I'm gonna have breakfast, breakfast with my son. Like, the, like the, the birds are all, you know, I work third shift. The birds are singing to us this morning. We're getting fresh air. Look at the sky. It's a beautiful day, right? My grass needs to be cut. My son will deal with it. He's gonna cut the grass this morning. Um, but we are gonna go shopping because, you know, I have the thrift store, I have a thrift store exchange and I actually did the box opening. This is going to be me shopping for Shannon. So, um, it's Thursday, May 23rd. So, before we go off and about, we're going to give the chicks a little treat. Um, I have three hens, three hens, and um, two orange, and a like coffee colored brown one. Um, I have to clean up their cage because it's looking kind of rough. But um, they are called Buffy, Penny, and Ombra. See, I'm letting them out. That right there. Hey, baby girls. Hey, baby girls. That's Penny. Okay. That's Mocha. That's an Easter egg. -er. She makes green eggs. And that's a, that's a Buff Warpington. It's Penny. And then that is an Easter Egger um, who makes the green eggs. She, they make dark brown eggs, this one here. And then we have, I think this one right here. This is Buffy. She's a big girl. And oh, we're laying eggs on the floor. So that tells me that she might actually be broody. And that means she might be sitting on some eggs. She might be sitting on some eggs. Are you upset? What's the matter, honey? You think you're gonna, you think you're gonna hatch some eggs with no rooster? You think you're gonna hatch some eggs with no rooster? I'll leave you alone. So in that case, you kind of have to, if she doesn't get off those eggs, she probably, she may not eat. Um, and that's a problem. Um, cause we don't have a rooster. Oh, she got off. <gasps> Ooh, look what we haven't done. Look what we have not done. She was sitting on some eggs and she's not broody. So that's good. I've got eggs. I've got to collect you guys. They have a collection. They have an area where they lay, but so I had four chickens. One passed away about, I don't know, almost a year ago. And these chicks are about three years old and I free range them. So I let them out of their massive, that pen is just too big for them. So they're free range irregardless. And they have their little fun and they get watermelon and blueberries and oatmeal. We're gonna collect their eggs. Hey baby girls. Hey baby girls. They're busy right now. But yeah, I've got a peach tree that's growing. And um, so, yeah, I'm trying to look and see if there's any peaches growing right now, you guys. Um, I know we had little fuzzy balls on here somewhere. Little fuzzy balls. See, this is, I'm in my, I'm in my element out here. Um, I don't see any fuzzy balls. But what I do know, and I know there was some fuzzy, fuzzy balls, but I don't see no fuzzy balls. We are going to see what we have 
come on, in the way of eggs. I think they're not laying, yeah, they're not laying, hold on, they're laying in the wrong spot. Huh, interesting. Baby girls, baby girls. So for some reason, they are, you could tell she was just, she just laid that one because that one was warm. Um, for some reason, the eggs, they're not laying where they should be. And look, there's one down here, which I'm not too sure about that one. I don't know. I don't know how long it's been out here for, but I'm gonna put it to the side. The dirty one, I know, is a questionable one. And they'll come back and have their watermelon. So you guys, got my eggs. I'm gonna make my breakfast with my fresh eggs. And then we're gonna go and grab a baby. And we're gonna work on our thrift store. Fines. Where are you going? Hey, where are you going, Buffy? Are, what are you doing? You follow me to the house? Yeah? Are you following me to my house, in the house? You cleaning your beak off? Yeah? I know what you want. You want blueberries? Yes. You want blueberries? What are you doing, honey buns? What? You say hello to everybody on YouTube? Huh? What? What? This one is my most, she's the boss lady. Oh, oh, come on. Yes. Yeah. You see my eggs? You see the eggs? Where's the number three at? They respond to that. My um, husband of the X sort, um, he trained them. Where's the third one? Where's Penny at? Penny! She's under there. She's coming. She's underneath the stairs. Hi, guys. Hi. After a long night of work, I threw on a pair of jeans and a pair of flip-flops. I got my I got my farm fresh eggs on my home-baked Kaiser roll. You guys really didn't think I made those Kaiser rolls, do you? Store-bought. Just trying to be extra. <laughs> you guys. All right. So I finished my sandwich and my watermelon. I even got some on me. It's like a little dot. Anyway. And we gotta figure out which beautiful bunker we're taking. Let's see. Who are we taking? I'm thinking maybe this one or this one. Um, who am I gonna take? Now I don't wanna get anybody dressed up right now. Um, she looks like she's ready to go. So we'll probably take So her. we have chosen little Melody. Melody. She's going to go to the store. And we're going to shop for Shannon. Ooh, Melody. Well, we're home. We stopped and got some ice cream. And it's noon. It's that time for me to go to bed. So I have, isn't it like noon? 11.29. So I have... Two hours to sleep. Get up. He will be doing the grass, right? I'm gonna take a shower. And you guys, that's it for me. I'm done shopping for now. Who knows? Maybe there'll be another trip. Um, maybe I'll do the boxing up. Or maybe this will be it. We are at the Hill of Miracles. <laughs> we hope they have something good. All right, Joseph said he's going to split. Also, in May is Foster Care Awareness Month. For the month of May, we will be taking donations for our foster care program. Please be aware at the time of checkout, we'll be asking for donations. Again, we thank you so much for your support. 
Let's see if there's any yellow tags. I need newborn. Let's see here. So what I'm shooting for is variety from newborns to zero to three months. And I thought that was pretty cool. That's like retro. And then this is cute. I like that. It's bright. It's cute. And then I found like set sort of like that. And then look at the butt. See the butt? Now watch this. It matches this. See the design on the booty? See it? That's cool. They really should be selling that as a set. They should be ashamed of themselves. And then also here's another one that could match it. That's pretty cool. I like the making sets with it. And then I like this. I don't know. I just like it. There's nothing wrong with it. So I thought that was nice. And then we have pink pants. Because, you know, I like pink. Just simple pink pants. And I thought this would be nice. I can wash this up. It looks really nice. It doesn't look used. And it'll nice, look nice with the pink pants. And then I have these pink pants, which I might keep these pants because they got bows. So I'm probably gonna nix one of those. And then this I like. It reminds me of the outdoors. You guys know I like the outdoors, right? I like it. And then I was getting a little adventurous with darker colors, but it should be washed. You know, it's probably washed a good bit. Um, she can put this with this, right? It has toesies. Okay. Or this with it, the little foxes. I thought that was pretty cool. And then, um, I have, well, I've got this, but it looked really new and I just liked it. Um, but I don't have anything to go with it. Maybe I'll find something to go with it. You know? Let's check on little Melody. I got her covered up right now. There she is, hanging out. There's the little bunker. I got out of work and I don't feel like dealing with people, but I took her with me. And Joseph's around here somewhere. I don't know where my son went to. He was like, deuces, mom, I'm gone. Oh, I tried to make my screen smaller. I don't know where he is. This is a rather large store. So. This is my partner in crime shopping at the Hill of Miracles. <laughs> we found some things. He thought he found like a computer. No, no a subwoofer, was, like a. It, and I realized it, it was like a set. It's a speaker. So, so you, you could run it by itself. Either that or it was just broken more than the other. So I decided against it, but I almost did. It would have been a steal though for the 975. It would Well. I, it's rather late. It's 11 o'clock and I'm usually in bed like right now. So what we're going to do is, Joe, what's the plan? Wait, I guess what? What are we going to get? I'm going to get some ice cream. <laughs> and then I'm going to go to bed. Hmm. And then I'm going to wake up to what? Hopefully some burgers. He's going to do the grass while I'm sleeping. Oh yeah, that's right. Because the yard <laughs> is a forest. It ain't that bad. <laughs> Around here, in these parts, if you don't cut your grass, even though it's an older neighborhood, we don't have an HOA. But if you don't cut your grass, they'll cut it for you, charge you, and then fine you. They did that to my neighbor. Wait, why would they charge you and then fine you? They charge you for someone to cut it. But then why would you fine? Because you already made them fine. Because they're trying to slap you on the wrist. Well, we should twist their wrist and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> so I wasn't going to actually do this video, part portion of the video. Um, I was kind of on the fence with it, packing the box for um, my 
thrift store exchange buddy. Um, I have a helper here. This is Capri. Is she beautiful? Um, she's here keeping me company. We are going to get this box packed up. Um, I'm going camping in the morning. And um, I'd like to get the box sent out. It's Friday morning, so I'd like to get the box sent out. So I'm going to show you um, what I've got here. We did lightly thrifted lightly thrifted we did a th we're doing a thrift store exchange but it's like lightly used stuff um close to new so um and then um you know i have stuff that i was i am gonna send her um we had a limit which we both went over <laughs> so um i'm gonna show you some stuff when we went to the thrift store, like I, I went to the thrift store, I was going to go to another one, but I was like, I have items that I can actually gift her, um, in this exchange. So I went through like a couple of my things for her. Um, I was trying to find headbands cause like little girls need headbands, right? Um, but the thrift store didn't have any, they had headbands, but they were stretched out or too big for a newborn's head. So what I did was, you know, I have an overabundance of newborn girl stuff. So I got this, you know, it's um, little roses for her. Um, and I've got this because there's plenty of pink in there. Plenty of pink. Okay. And then um, this because there's a pattern in there that I got from the thrift store that actually matches this. And it's like so weird because I actually like this pattern, but it, when it comes to like putting it on my dolls, I'm not crazy about it. But and I think it's because maybe too much yellow. I don't know, but I wanted to like something that kind of matched something neutral pink and then, you know, something to match what she has in there. Um, I mean, it's lovely, but so what I'm going to do is with these headbands, I'm going to go ahead and put them in packaging um, for my box closing so that they're in there and they're done. And um, so like as I show you, I'm going to prepare the items. So I'm just going to put all those headbands in here nicely for her. Um, just like that. Um, I'm not really sure how I'm going to pack this. But um, I think I'm just going to do just like that, pack it like that. And then I'm going to tape the back down. You guys, like I was supposed to do this a lot earlier because I wanted to get this sent out. I have to go get like a little bit of firewood because I'm camping locally, but not locally, like within an hour away. And you're supposed to buy the firewood close to the campground. But, like, I'm essentially, I am close to the campground. I'm, like, an hour or less. Um, so, hold on. I want to make sure I do this right. Okay. So, yeah, we're going to go camping on the lake. And I'm debating which baby I want to bring. Why did this happen? You know when you get the tape stuck to itself? Okay. Let me do another one. So, I'm trying to decide what baby I want to bring. And the one that I want to bring, Sandra's like, be careful with that one. I said, I know. Okay, so we got the headbands in here, and baby girl's going to hold that, okay? Um, and then I actually wanted to give her, gift her um, a pacifier, but I'm trying to do, like, neutral stuff so she can use it for everything. Um, I love these honey bugs. And then I just have, like, a generic. I have two of these, um, but it's neutral, and you can use it boy, girl, like, if she ever got a new um baby so i have it set the baby that she has she had adopted from me so i know that one of my girls fit the same as she did because i went back in my photos and i noticed she was wearing the same magnetized pacifier that the that the baby she has was wearing so i know she'll fit this one but with the honey bugs shannon who's doing this with me i don't know if you know you can pop this off the front off and you could change out the side of the pacifier if you had another baby in the future that you would like to use it on so I thought that was nice I'm gonna actually put that in this um, I'll put some tissue paper in it but that's gonna go in there 
Um, and I'll get tissue paper in that. So then I'm going to give her, these are like Pura diapers um, from, I took them out of my pack. I had two of them from my stash of my of diapers. And I want to say they're Amazon, like good diapers. Um, so I'm going to fold them up and I'm going to go put them in this other Oh Baby pack. Um, I was going to actually make this video be a lot quicker than this because I thought I had everything put together, but I kind of want to show you guys what I'm doing here. Um, you know, but at least I can show you guys and kind of pack it a little bit and then I can finish just packing the box maybe before I send it out or something. I don't know. I'll get the majority of it done. So, okay. Now let me show you what I guys, what I got. I showed you a lot of it, but I think I threw some things in here, but I'm not 100% sure. Okay, so um, there's this. This matches the um, the headband. Um, you can essentially take any onesie you want and um, make outfits with it with a pair of pants. Look at this. I like this. I actually like this. And I found these, you guys, not at Goodwill. I found these at, um, uh, what do you call it? Miracle Hill. Miracle Hill, in the next town over or so, has some really nice things. Um, I brought them home. I threw them in the wash machine, washed them in some good old-fashioned Tide. And I love this. I just couldn't find anything to go with it. It has the little, the little bow. Um, I thought that was nice. Um, and I'm going to figure out how I'm going to wrap this stuff up. Because um, I don't have a lot of tissue paper. I mostly use my tissue paper for like covering the top, top of the box. But what I might do, you guys don't see the top of my head. I have plenty of these. So I might put some of them in these. Um, let's see, I can roll some of it up nicely. I don't want to mess up this flower here. I could roll them up maybe and put them in here. I want it to be nice. You know what I mean? Um, I can put that one in there nicely. Um, and then I could put these two onesies in here because they kind of match, you know, um, they match and that'll be nice. So, you know, I, I always like inter, I like engaging, that's the right word, engaging with my followers, you guys. You guys are amazing. And actually, it was Shannon that reached out to me and she's like, I have an idea for a video, if you're willing. And I was like, oh, sounds fantastic. She doesn't have a, a YouTube, but she is going to, um, she's going to, I don't know, when I, when I adopted out um, the baby I adopted out to her, she sent me a personal video of her opening um, the baby and my butt sends baby clothes. I mean, I sent some of them fit, but I sent some, I sent her a nice box opening, but some of the clothes were a little big for the baby, um, but some were just fine. So I don't want to go crazy with all the same stuff. So I think I have, I have some of these white ones as well. I have all different colors. Well, not all different colors, but we'll use some white. Okay. All right. So then I have, um, I wanted to send, I've got these pink pants, you know, from the thrift store um, that I had, but then I have stuff like this. This is Cat and Jack. This was actually come from my collection. Um, I think it was used like one time. And um, I have so much baby stuff, so... Um, and then I have this that I had gotten from the thrift store. And it's a onesie. It smells good. I love things that smell good. Um, and then this I got from the thrift store. It's a onesie. A lot of these are onesies. But like I said, she could put pants with it. And I like this because it felt so good. It felt so good, you guys. It felt so good. So um, I think I'm going to wrap some of this up in tissue paper, but I only have, um, 
it's going to wind up being more than the paint if I wrap things up in tissue paper. Um, sorry, you guys. You guys are missing my big old head. Um, well, I got purple. I can do purple as well. Um, I can wrap some stuff up. You know, just to vary it up a little bit. I like, if I can, do a little variation. Um, you know. So, put a little tape on it. Boom. Okay. And then, I got these onesies here. Um, I might put those in one of those white little sachet things. Onesies, a little onesies. Look at that little pink pants. Yeah, I fell asleep on the couch with my son. We had dinner. He came home from work. Um, he we had dinner, and then he fell asleep on the couch. Um, we both fell asleep on the couch, and here it was. It was like one in the morning, and I'm like, oh my god, oh my god. Um, you know, I wanted to do this video. And um, I wanted to pack the box. So first thing in the morning when I go get firewood, I'll also have this box packed. I was like, oh no, let me see if I can, you know, I, you guys know once I'm up, it's harder for me to go to sleep. Um, it's over for me once I'm up, you know. So um, I think I'm gonna pack this as a set um, and I'll put it in tissue. Um, I think that'll be nice so she can get like a set because this is actually this one's from my personal collection um, but like like we said lightly used and I'm sure we both went over a limit just a little bit but we're cool with that we're cool we are cool with that she's gonna have a little bit of a colorful box thing what do you call it is it a box opening yeah it's a box opening. It's going to be colorful, but she'll be okay with that. You know, I'll make it look nice and pretty. Um, I don't have any, well, no, I do have cute stickers. Maybe I'll put my little heart stickers on that. Um, you know, and then I found these pants at the thrift store that matches this top this onesie and this guys it was amazing but you know what kills me they sell it as one um one item each and my thrift store used to be like a dollar a piece and now it's just under two two dollars a piece I think it's like a dollar 75 um a piece but I mean still I was like wow I found this stuff um, all together, you know, and then I, I washed it all because I'm not going to send her stinky thrift store clothes, you know, I don't even think they, I used to think, I mean, I get the clothes from any thrift store, I'm going to wash them, but I used to think they did like a courtesy wash or something at least. I don't know. Maybe it's in my head. So then look, check this out. So I like this. I found this top. You guys know I love animals, right? And then, and you guys, this don't even look like, it looks beautiful condition. And then I found two pairs of pants to match. Two, see the fox? And it's got footies, okay? And then there's one very similar, but it's not the same. Then there's forest animals. You guys, I like this. I almost kept this for myself because, um, I just thought it was cute, 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 cute. Now, I usually don't put dark colors on my babies, but if I happen to, I do um, put a white onesie or a lighter onesie underneath because I get very paranoid about colors with the babies. Um, so that's just a tip. I don't know if everybody else gets that way, but um, you know, this is an exciting, this is exciting. I'm excited. I never. I didn't do a thrift store exchange. I'm putting the things in the box as I wrap them because I'm running out of room. And then I've got this unicorn, right? Onesie. This is from the thrift store now, okay? 
And then I've got, and it's uh, geranimals. A lot of those geranimals and um, common uh, names. And then I found matching pants, you guys. It matches. And then I was like, wait a minute. Like, I don't have a lot of newborn baby unicorn stuff. Um, only unicorn newborn baby stuff I had was this. It's another onesie. And, you know, mixing and matching, I'm learning to do that because I, I normally like sets. But I thought that was pretty cool. So I said, I'm going to go ahead and send her the onesie that I have that's unicorn. Because I don't have anything, you know, to match with it. Um, but I thought that was pretty neat. Pretty neat. Um, but shopping for, I'm going to be honest. Um, shopping for a, a girl, newborn girl, is so much easier than a boy. Because she had trouble. She had to do newborn boy for me. I felt bad for her. So you got these little girl pants and they got the, the ruffled bows on the side like they're cinched. And I thought that was so cute. And I love dainty stuff. This is like pears, like little pears maybe. Wait, you see the pattern? I thought that was nice. Um, I thought that was really nice. So I was like, I gotta get that. Cause that's like, I like dainty type things. Um, so I thought that would be a nice, nice thing to send, um, to send her, um, you know, okay, all right, and then we have, so this was for my, I just gave her a regular pink onesie um Gerber onesie and I had found this I actually like the print it's hearts but it's like cheetah and I didn't have any I could not find a top to go with it like that matched it but I said well maybe if I just did like pink on pink or something I was just trying to make sets so that's what I basically came up with um I I have plenty of pink in my collection you guys you, you guys know that so I'm gonna put that together as a set um and she can you know she can decide what she wants to do, you know, with it. But I did like the bottoms. I thought the bottoms were, like, nice. You know what I mean? Um, you guys, let me tell you what I found in my first store. Well, it's the next town over. Um, I have a good rule in this town. And the next town over is a Miracle Hill. And I like Miracle Hill in the next town over. Um, beautiful outfit. Beautiful. But... The outfit had the biggest poop stain in the back. Like a baby exploded. And the mother took the clothes off and just was like, I'm giving it to this the the, the Miracle Hill or whatever. I'm moving this a little bit. I was like, ugh. You know, like really? You're going to hang this up and sell this? I really like this. This is Carter's. This is one size fits all. But you guys know, like, look at that. I love girly floral. Um, it has the hand that folds over. It is a long dress, like sleeper type deal thing. I love it because it reminds me of the springtime, the pattern. I, I love this. Absolutely love this. Um, and I hope she loves it too. Um, so beautiful, beautiful. I almost kept this one as well. Because <laughs> I thought it was cute, you know? Um, get my tissue paper over here. So I thought that was nice. Um, and I'm hoping to get this stuff sent out in the morning, which is Friday morning, which is already Friday morning. Um, it's just like probably one, one fifteen in the morning now, one twenty in the morning. Um, and then last but not least, I like retro stuff and I know like Easter's past, but I liked this. Um, this is retro like maybe 90s or something is that a string all right she can i don't have a scissor and i'm scared if i pull it that it'll unravel and i don't want it to because it's so pretty it's so pretty it's little me it's newborn it doesn't you can't find that stuff like this in the store um and it's got the little bows on the feet see what happened baby clothes being so cute like this 
don't know if you can see it. Can you see it? I don't know. But I think it's beautiful. I'm not going to pull that string. I'm going to let her go ahead and cut it and decide what she wants to do with it. Because, But I do like this. I almost kept this one too. Because I like the real bows on it. You know, like you see the little baby bows. See, I love stuff like that. But, um, and a lot of this stuff is long sleeves. But you guys, um, I try to be really careful with my babies. And all my babies are in long sleeves. And it's May. We're going into June. And, there's a, and I do that because, for one, to protect my reborns. Definitely. Um, and then, of course, my cuddle babies. Right? I got Capri over there. I do it for my cuddle babies. I do it to protect them. Um, you know, I'm, I'm very careful with my little bunkers. Um, and, you know, sometimes it's unavoidable. As we change our babies and over time, that rub off may happen. I mean, that's just part of it. All right. I know I brought my sticker in here to put on some of this stuff. Like I got little silver stickers to put shiny stickers, but okay. So you guys, um, I've got all her stuff in here and I don't know why so I started putting them in these just to switch it up a little bit. Um, give a little variety. Um, I got to put some tissue paper in this thing here. I've got the old baby pack here. Um, so am I missing something? I feel like I'm missing something. Oh yeah, something fell. I knew I had two of these, okay. So, you guys, all I gotta do now is I'm gonna put tissue paper in here, I'm gonna put a smelly good, I might put some Wonder Wafers in here, um, and I'm gonna send it to her. I don't wanna make this too long-winded, but I'm gonna fine tune the box, I'm gonna send her a little letter, and that's it. Um, I hope you guys love this. If you guys ever have any ideas for videos, I am more than welcome. I'm, I'm, I'm open with you guys when it comes to like happy mail or just reach out to me via email. Um, when it comes to happy mail, exchanges, like thrift store exchanges or um, anything, you know? So um, I'm willing to do that. It does, like I said, uh, it takes me time to respond to anybody um through email i mean in any way because i'm you know we we live lives we have other lives outside the dog com community um and so but i hope you guys enjoyed this um i love every one of you thank you so much for your support all my viewers are so amazing um i i really do value each and every one of you from the bottom of my heart. And the ones that are here are meant to be here. Uh, um, you know, sometimes you don't click with certain people. And that's fine. That's fine. Not everybody in this world is going to like you and appreciate you. But I appreciate every one of you. Without you guys, you wouldn't be here. Like, subscribe, comment. You know, um, just give me time to get to the comments. <coughs> um, but thank you guys so much. Um, if... Check, check, see if you're subscribed because there's a lot of you that are not subscribed and you watch. So many of you watch. It, my um, analytics tell me um, people that watch me versus people that like your, re your regular viewer, like you have regular viewers or something and then your subscribers and it tells you the percentage of each. We got to get, we got to get it high. The subscriber count above the viewer, like because a lot of you that watch me aren't subscribed, it seems. So anyway, I love all of you. Thank you so much. You guys are amazing. You're amazing. I love you all. Until next time. Bye. Shannon, I hope you love your stuff. Bye.